There we go. That's the gun. That's the recording started, hopefully. Have you guys done I it? I didn't do it. No. You know, I did do it. I'm joking. Oh, yeah. I'm joking. Okay. I did do it. For the viewers, these morons just spent like two hours trying to like press the button and they couldn't do it. They missed every single time. For the time. viewers. View I'm a bit of a joker. The viewers need to know every single like element of production because it's important to to, to know. But yeah, welcome, ah. welcome, ladies and gentle nuts to the uh, what is this? And and gentle days. And that to the HCU podcast <laughs> episode. F uh, what number is this? Five. We're at five, guys. We're at nearly at double digits already. Give yourself a round. No, we're not. No, we are. We are. We're nearly at double digits. Think about it. Five is rounded up. In the to grand like scheme 10. of things, yeah. Yeah. But like, this is the most consistent show we've ever done, and we're really, uh, we're really making strides in the industry. So, who has a topic? Because I have a few, but I don't want to, you know, shoot them too quick. Hackme, you got anything? You haven't said anything yet. Come on. <sighs> Hackme. <laughs> He's muted. <laughs> Well, I have a topic. Oh, what's your topic? Uh, yeah, if, if someone mutes, about... just ignore them. They, they don't exist. They don't uh, okay. so What's your topic? What have you got? Let's talk about... Oh, no. Nah. You're not going to be ready for oh, this. If it's, if it's fucking cringe. Why did you just stop your recording? What? Why? You could just... No, that's funny. You could just edit that out. It's Keep fine. Keep going. I'm editing the... I do! I literally do! You ape. Well, have fun aligning this. What? It's like an old married couple. <laughs> Did you actually stop it? Yeah, I started. It's, fucking... it's fine. I've on my computer anyway. <sighs> Wait, what if we both make a really loud sound when the clock gets to like eighteen thirty-six? <laughs> like, whoa! I'm so fucking mad. Why did you stop it? Should we just keep going? Yeah, just keep going. I don't care. Like, this is this is. Okay, uh, this is I'd like to talk about lost care. media. Lost it's media. It's just something. Re what do you mean? Really interests me. What do you mean lost media? Uh. Like, it, like shit media? that hasn't, like, they made, and then they, like, all the copies of it got burnt away or something. What, are you talking about most of the HGU videos? No, oh, that's not true! They still exist! They're still here. Uh, yeah, so, <laughs> we never lost them. media is when a piece of media is believed to be lost forever and irretrievable, although, like, there's documentation of its existence, and there mm. has to be, like, a people knowing about it and caring about it. That is kind of sick, I'm not gonna lie. I think it's quite cool. Yeah. I think we should lose some HCU videos. I don't, we're not going to lose any HCU videos. Every single video is kept up and stored by our archivists in the uh, in the studios. I think it's archivists. Archivists? 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 Yeah. I think they're the same word, if I'm thinking about it correctly. Yeah, but you, you, you didn't say it right, you said it wrong. Oh, that's not true. Tomato, tomato, you know? What is objectively correct? Tomato or tomato? Is there an objective? Well, correct? that depends where you're from. But, like, no one says archivists, because that's just wrong. Like, no one says that I in any country. I just did! This one time... Well, yeah, but you're time, in a little country of your own, aren't you? This one time, I went to this other country. Did like, I just it? couldn't understand what they were saying. It was almost as if they were speaking a different language. <laughs> you fucking... You little slug. <laughs> yeah. They were speaking another language, bro. Oh, we're... Lucky to be from the UK and people speak English, you know. It's lucky, very. Yeah, but if you were, if you were like Spanish, and oh you yeah. Spoke if I was Spanish and you lived in Spain, yeah. If I was Spanish, crazy. I'd be pissed. But why? <laughs> because no one was. If I went to France, no one would speak Spanish. I'd just be lost. I actually have. To yeah, but if you guys are all oh, true. Yeah, it would see, be... that's a good point about It'd the shit. after effects of the British Empire. We've, we've, we can go on holidays really easy. It's great. Yeah. So I'm a big fan of that. The, however, I'm just gonna go back on the topic of what's it? Lost media? Lost media. Yeah. Uh, so I was watching oh. a video about lost media, a specific piece. Mm. What piece? It was really interesting. It's called "The Day the Clown Cried," <laughs> and apparently uh, it might be released in 2024. How? What? Like well, they've the been thing. retrieving it, retrieving pieces. Or whatever. I think I seen I... that film. Didn't that come out in like October 2019? Did you just no. look that up? No, we saw it in the <laughs> cinema, remember? I can oh, guarantee you did Joker. Not see it. Yeah, that's Joker. Nah, shut up. <laughs> no, no, that is the day the crown clown cried is Joker. Joker <laughs> wasn't 2019, was it? Yeah, it was. I think it was, yeah. Oh, I feel old. It's an old, it's a long, it's a long running classic, you know? It's, it's, a, 
It's a classic now, legally. Oh, really? You know? No, it kind of is. And people like. Look... If Joker was in 2020, he'd be like, You want to know how I got this COVID, Batman? You want to know how I got the vaccine? <laughs> <laughs> How did he get the vaccine? Joker when he's in the 50 to like 60 age bracket, like, oh, you wanna know how I got this oh, vaccine? Oh, can I just say, I hate COVID. And like... I think that's an unpopular more, more opinion. More specifically, every single piece of media now, like, that is produced is like, Oh, isn't it so sad that we're all at home? It's really annoying, there's so <laughs> much of it now. Cause like, you see, like... Oh, what was it? I was watching some Seinfeld, and there was an ad midway through about like this new show which was all filmed in someone's home and during lockdown and it, and they it doesn't feel it's not it's not interesting particularly because it's maybe it's your fault for watching Seinfeld <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no 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 but it's like you like people people make films that like explore these themes and stuff and then like the the lockdown stuff, the lockdown art is meant to be exploring that theme, but everyone is experiencing it, so it doesn't. You don't learn anything. They, they, everyone knows. Like what? The, it would be like making a documentary about like, uh, going to sleep. Yeah. Well, no, because that kind of kind of. Oh shit! Everything kind of has a bit extra to it, but it's like, if someone made a documentary about the time I went to Tesco and bought some milk or something, you like, it, 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 people just do that anyway. People go to the shops. They just buy milk. To link the topics of videos that Reese has made what? and lost media, I wish that Race Man was lost media. Oh, can't. I wish. I am so glad it's not. It's a part of our history. It is lost media. It's off of it's YouTube. It's not lost. It's not. Yeah, but it's not lost. We still have it. I have it. Copies. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't apologize. It's a good thing that it's alive and well and living and ready for viewing. And uh, at the YouTube link in the description below, eh? We're gonna upload it for this as a tie-in, right? I think that's. I think one thing about lockdown is it was really different for everyone. Like a lot of people changed. I think I changed massively. So here's a question for for the for the cast members and for the audience at home oh, to yeah. ask themselves and reflection: What do you think would happen if pre-lockdown one you met post-lockdown three you? Lockdown three? We're in the third one. We are in lockdown three right now. So like around this time, Wait. you met you in like March last year. Wait, we're on the third one. I thought we were on the second. No, we're on the third one. Are we? Reese, you just don't leave your house ever. <sighs> there was a second no, lockdown. No, 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 no. Because we went to school during lockdown too. Like they kept oh, schools open. Oh, I don't count that. That's like I'm I'm still going to school. Like that's different. That's like only half. I, I don't School is the answer. only time the scientists let you see other beings. Unbelievable. Do you remember when scientists. they were like, school is the safest place for young people? Right <laughs> the scientists. They were like, as long as you sit down in the common room, you will not catch COVID because it's in the air, not the ground. And then they were <laughs> like, it's not the school buildings that are dangerous. It's the mixing inside of them. Obviously. <laughs> no, the building's out to get you. It keeps... The, like, vents keep coughing on me. Yeah. Speaking the of vents... vents r sus among us. I'm not talking... Look, okay, I need we need to stop talking about... I like how we didn't answer I'm your question. We're not talking about it. Huh? What question? You know, I asked you guys a question because you're... Yeah, I'm and really I like how you just didn't... No, I've really forgotten the answer. question. What's the question? No, Reese doesn't care because he hates you. Oh, no, no. You. If, if my version of me from March 20... Whatever the fuck. When, 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 when do we leave? I don't care. That 2020 time. was the start. Yeah, but I don't know the date. What then? Anyway, then and like me now, the the previous version of me, no, my the version of me now would tell the version of me to make more like videos and shit, and not waste and not like not. I'm not gonna say waste my time, but uh, make more videos, just because it would be better now for me if I had had if I'd made a bit more. If we'd started the HCU cast start of lockdown one, we'd be fucking balling right now. We kind we of so did. Annoyed. We just didn't upload any of them. True, and that's gonna th and that's gonna be good for the intermissions, and that'll be great. My computer fan is really loud right now, so if it's in the final cut, then it's oh, we ASMR. can just use like a Premiere Pro and just out, you know, yeah. cut it out. Not cut it out, but audio reduction. I need to start using that because I feel like I feel like some of the audio quality is gonna be quite uh, tricky, especially with three people. What and about you, that audio uh, Pluto? Cool. What do you think you're? Reaction. Well, yeah. in March last year, I was very, very different mm -hmm. oh, yeah, yeah. in very, very many ways. Yeah. And I think 
if I saw myself now, I'd be very happy. That's good. But at the same time, I think it would make it quite difficult because who I am now is very different in the way that if past me saw that, then they'd be like, uh, well, what the fuck do I do now? Yeah. Because I've changed yeah. so much. Mm-hmm. Aye, aye. Because now I have, like, the non-binary mullet. I'm skinny. Mm. I'm cool. Mm-hmm. I'm really, really mullet. sexy. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know this. And mullet. I had none of those things before. Yeah, no, I'm growing out my mullet. Is it a mullet? What's a mullet? I don't even know. People say things about mullets, but I don't, I don't know what a mullet is. Reese, if you're not studying all of the pictures of me on my Instagram, <laughs> I don't, I don't, my hair I don't. Is, you don't know me. Also, quick uh, shout Never. out to my spam account at Duh, on Instagram bleak, and my main account. Watches all the Metroid viewers come crawling <laughs> to you. Good luck talking to Drew. Wait, we're just we're gonna just, be. No, no, no. If, if any of us ever advertise on Instagram, we just get doxxed. That's what's gonna happen. Yeah, true. Yeah, let's. Will not... I get doxxed? Nah. That's why I'm so scared of I'm having like a public be Instagram doxed. because all my friends will follow it. All of my friends make it really obvious where they live. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Stupid. It only takes one they person live. with their like Easy. location in their bio to be in your followers lists for the EDL to find you. <laughs> By the way, if I say anything offensive today, my name is. <laughs> Thank you. You're gonna have to edit that out, Reese. No, I'm not editing that out. Well, oh, then we're ending it then. <laughs> no, we're only like 20 minutes in, or something. I don't know. I've been timing it. 15, I think. Wait, is that private information? Nah, who gives one? I've said his name on the cast many times. He said my name. He said some random guy's name. name. That's kind of hot. It's kind of romantic. You guys say each other's name a lot on the cast. Kind of very cute and adorable, but I have to call him Hack Me because you know we're not we're not married yet. I'm gonna legally change my last name to H S. It's gonna be great. I thought S was the what? His 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 uh, Discord username is H dot S, which I'm still pissed about. I want it to be Hack Me. Put it back to Hack Me, bro. I don't don't like H S. I still prefer the hack, mate. I don't care what you like. Anyway, oh, man. well, back to the original, very first topic that we have gone on like seven different tangents from. He is a perfect cast when you go on massive. Of tangents. lost media is something that really interested me, because the thing about the day the clown cried is there were like twelve different reasons why it's lost, and it's also a really shit film. <laughs> like the production is bad, the plot is bad, the director just didn't turn up for like ninety-nine percent of it. A lot like an HD so video. Lost. So um, when they release it in twenty twenty-four, people might just not like it. <laughs> You're telling me it should have stayed lost, is what I'm hearing. That's well, what I'm there's hearing. there's a chance it will be because they might just not let it out. Okay, I have a question. Good. Mm-hmm. Come mm. up with, uh... If, if I gave you the money to make a film right now, what would it be? <sighs> yeah, yeah. But how much? You gotta say how much. No, I don't. Pluto, what would it be? <laughs> I'd make, uh... <sighs> psychological body horror uh, with a happy ending about transforming into uh, like featherless malformed angel and it's like really horrible how the character the main character who would be played by me because I'd act and direct in it because I'm really sexy that's not a good idea Uh, it would be really horrible how they just like find themselves like changing and transforming and at the very end they're just like oh this is cool Uh, and they leave I would not recommend being a director and an actor that's like in the same thing. Okay, so mine no. mine would be very, very Bad similar. Idea. In other words, the exact same thing, except they start to become this little blue hedgehog. And they <laughs> develop oh, this God. ability to run really, really fast. You know what? For the viewers back home, I was really excited to be on this podcast. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, not. I don't know why. I'm Can I go on? Yeah, I'm just going to go on that for a little bit. Why are there so many people <laughs> clamoring to be on this piece of shit? This is hilarious, but like, what is wrong with you? I wasn't clamoring. I was extending you were, you an were offer. Clamoring. I'm sorry. You were begging. I am the sexiest person you will ever meet. I don't know if you know <laughs> that. That is that. true. And me being it's on this podcast. Our oh, viewer ratings it's... going up, boys. <laughs> oh, there's no, there's no face cam. This is fucked. We we'll say no. The I would entire, my the face entire cam view on, of I'm this one sexy. is just gonna be a picture of uh, Pluto. No, that's not. True. Can I send the picture? Can no. I choose the Pluto? No, 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 no. It's not. That's not gonna be the background. That is not. Can you at least add one image of me? Sure, sure. Fade it in now. Uh, 
Put Wait, the, during the bit where I'm talking about my film, I already have for my art project an image of the angel. Yeah, I was comes, thinking about so that. We can put that. That's a cool. Yeah, picture. yeah, yeah. Angel. But during this bit where I'm talking about how sexy I am, we need to have some sexy, sexy proof. <laughs> ne Neon Genesis Evangelion. Holy shit. I look just like all of the characters in that combined, by the way. I've never ever watched that show, and I'm not sure how much I care to. Like, apparently, okay. it's, apparently it's good. But to be honest, it feels like the sort of one you'd watch, like recently watch what? like on a sofa covered in like cereal and milk and like oh, cereal stuff and milk. like crying his eyes out i, I don't cry i never cry i might Do you not cry never maybe that's why you are like that's you are crying yeah that's the next crying. topic never in my crying life is good. Like, hello ladies and welcome to never? episode five of the sad podcast today we're going to be talking about crying <laughs> no, on no, no, camera this, <laughs> this is the first this is the fifth episode of the hc podcast and the first episode of the cringe cast and we're going to be talking about cringe for the whole episode <laughs> Have you really never cried in your whole life? No, of course. I was a little baby once that cried about the wind, you know, baby. But I don't. I think cry I cried now. like yesterday. Nah, I don't cry. The only, the closest I ever get is when I'm watching something that's really, really, why did, really good. Why did you cry I mean, yesterday? My eyes burn a little bit. Oh, um, I think I cried yesterday putting contact lenses in, but like uh, a couple uh, of days ago I cried because I was sad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's just that's, that's you know, that's just how it is. Yeah, it's a bit weak to cry though. I've decided. Hey. Sure. Unless you can bottle your tears Ascendance. and turn them into- I- Okay, wait. Funny story. I had a clock once that ran on salt water. It's like a f science experiment. Salt and I used water. to think about really sad things to power it and cry into the little tube. <laughs> <laughs> Why wouldn't you just put salt water in it? You just go downstairs and- Plus because money in salt. it. Well, yeah. well, no, because I was at my nan and granddad's at the time and I didn't know where the salt was. <laughs> you didn't know where the salt was. <laughs> <laughs> that was a resource one I was looking for. In the youth of Britain. Wait, what? Uh, Join the Navy. Uh, yeah, okay, first sponsor. Oh, can Navy. we talk about Navy? Yeah, let's talk. Uh, I, we're gonna have I a don't want to talk about the Navy. the Navy. I was made on the HCU pod. No, I was born on the HCU. No, I was born in a <laughs> uh, redacted location, but I was made on the HCU. On the HCU <laughs> <podcast>. <laughs> I love, legitimately, I love those ads. I've been on like. The topic of crying. Oh, what? We're talking about um, the Navy? Yeah, I Nah, okay, nah, I'm crying in the Navy. About... Nah, nah, not allowed. It's against rules. But yeah, we talk about crying. You have a, something to say about crying? Yeah, like whenever I go outside, like yeah, I I always just cry and I don't really know why. I'm so pretty sure it's just because fever. I have sensitive eyes. But what happens is um, I don't think it's, um, I don't think it's what crying. happens what happens is like in my head it's like oh why am I crying? But it's just because I have sensitive eyes, and then I'm like, wait, I'm sad. And then I'll actually cry. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. Because I have see, to like, like, justify it, you know? You have, have to justify it. Yeah. I get that same thing. Uh, I, well, you already know, I get the same thing where, like, um, if I But with being on... racist. No, that's not what I said. What? That's what you said. But, like, I'm related. Uh, yeah, yeah, I go outside sometimes. My eyes all. I don't think I don't think you can call that crying. You call it. I call it, like, just my eyes water, right? Yeah. And then you, like, and then, I then never you, cry, then, and then reveals he cries every time he leaves the house. Then hack me, you cry. I don't cry. My eyes just like get a bit wet, and I'm like, oh shit. And then I just wipe it away, and I go on with my day. I don't even think about it because it's just something that happens. Like just doesn't need a reason. My eyes are just not functional, you know. Whenever we record these, I always think, oh, well, if someone listens to this, their opinion of me will be lowered. But no one listens to these, so I'm fine. True. People will listen to this one. I feel. No. No. Well, people listen to I that. think there's always something very special about this particular <laughs> part. Yeah. yeah, for some reason, ha uh, ha Hackney is actually high on crack right now. I think it was gonna- I, th I thought it was That's gonna be funny, what... but it's sort of- No, it is true. This is the drug cast now, we're gonna be talking about heroin. <laughs> talk about drugs. Yeah, yeah, what do you guys think about heroin? <laughs> I actually really dislike heroin. Of course. Really? Train spotting. I don't like the taste. I thought that <laughs> because taste. you're a liberal, you would have loved that kind of thing. <laughs> okay, let me let me take a second because I knew that it would not be long on the HCU cast oh. before my political. This is the second. This is the second episode of the political cast, boys. <laughs> to all the Metroid fans listening right now, oh, there's cut. none. They're all gone. Yeah, they're all gone. I will not reveal ago. my political leanings because I know who you are <laughs> you and what you stand for. <laughs> <laughs> I know that, that you bad. guys look at Samus Metroid and think we should have less immigrants. Oh, how? <laughs> that's true. You know, people playing oh, Metroid true. 2 be like, no, never mind. This that's, is why that's we racist. shouldn't import. I can't say that. This is why we shouldn't import Metroids into. The <laughs> people UK. playing Metroid 2, getting rid of, doing a genocide on the Metroids, be like, 
Why don't we have people? this in real life? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I so uh, I don't like heroin despite the fact that I think that gay people should have rights. <laughs> it's not. Uh, it's really I know that they're right. closely interlinked, <laughs> but I. Uh, yeah. There's a high rates of heroin consumption. Heroin is shit, mm. but crack is kind of cool. Shut up. Like, no, 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 in my head, it's like, her if I did heroin, I would be a loser. But if I did crack, it would be like, nice. And then so, if I did, like, um, something else. Pluto. You know what, Rishi, you do both at the same time and just be normal. Ah, I'm normal. Tell us, I, I tried um, being normal once. Tell us about your, well. your, um, art, if you want. You can talk about that if you want. Art? Art isn't really? real. Yeah. Can I art isn't real. Oh, okay, I'll talk about my art, but first Let's on the topic art. of drugs. Uh, I, I actually uh, should start taking more drugs, but I have an addictive personality, so I can't yeah. take things because I get addicted to them really quickly, which really sucks. But yeah, addicted I'm addicted crime. as well. Yeah, I know you're to addicted the to the HCU podcast. I'm addicted to the grind, boys. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, okay. So my art, uh, I, I, I used to do like stage and special effects makeup to turn myself into like. <laughs> like visions of like a, a human in like different <laughs> ways but now I'm moving into post-human and uh, references to like angelic stuff and also like other Pets. creatures and also like cryptids because mm -hmm. I feel like I've surpassed uh, human yeah. physiology in my art what, what draws you to that kind of thing? um I think it started when I started hating straight people <laughs> wow no, that's a joke. Oh. Uh, sorry to the Metroid fans. Again. <laughs> I told you sorry they're all uh, gone. I'm... Yeah, apart from apart I'm from Druid Force, nice one, mate. Thanks for sticking around. For some reason. I'm drawn to that sort of stuff because uh, often I feel very disconnected to my body, and I feel like if I had this weird, contorted body, I'd have a whole new way to explore it without having years of being tied to it constantly. I'd be able to like learn how to be a body for the first time in a way that I have control over. Yeah. Uh, that's cool. I don't get it, personally. <laughs> to all the straight people listening to this, imagine how much you like football and, uh, <laughs> I love like, football. kissing, and then just apply it to that. Oh, I love kissing and football. And I like all of those things. I don't no, think you've done yeah, either of them too. your entire oh, yeah. life. That's what I was thinking. What the fuck? <laughs> no, 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 no. This is... But I don't, I hate both football. both at the same time. Okay, can I say, I, hate, I despise football. football. Okay, no, 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 I don't play football and I don't watch it, but when I was in year five and six, I, I love playing goalkeep. That was always fun. It's like such a... Yeah, because you don't have to speak to anyone and you can be far away from everyone yeah, yeah, on the pitch. Yeah, you can chill at the back lines and you can just be like, hey, bro, what's going on? And you just have a chat. And then so when, your favourite like, thing about football is like when, when you had to play it, but you didn't have to do anything. Except, uh, yes. So in other because, words, you because don't then, like football. Because then you, 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 if your team is decent... Then you just mm. stop one or two goals. You were a football neat, the hero. weren't you? <laughs> like any. Actually, actually, back in the day, back in the far day, I'm talking like like young, young. I used to. Uh, I was in a football club, but um, they wanted to move me up to the next section, but it would have interfered with my scouts or my Cubs or whatever the hell it was at the time. And I chose to stick with the Cubs. I would be a very different person if I'd cut off the scouts and went with that football. I still believe that. God, I wish that had happened. Dude, you wouldn't, you wouldn't know me. It wouldn't happen. I, I wouldn't know Hassan. That's the point. He'd just be a weirdo to me. And he still is. <laughs> I'd be playing football Wait, did you guys eyes. meet in Scouts? No. No, no. no. Oh, I'm just, God, I'm just God, saying I'm that I would like... Scouts. I would I have been... Scouts. Weird. Shut up! You're mean. I, I, I went to there. Scouts. My Scout story is actually a, a sob story. Because oh, I went to like Beavers, Cubs, all that shit. Mm. Can I swear? Yeah, yeah. Go fucking ahead. You Are we not going to get demonetized? It's fine. No, we, we, we don't get money off it yet. We, yet. we will never make money off of okay, anything. Okay, uh, I no, went we through we all of the Beavers and Scout stuff, and then when I went to actual Scouts, uh, they they wouldn't talk to me, and they kept making bad Lord of the Rings puns. Oh. Lord and of I the think, Rings puns. I think, yeah. Yeah, it was just That's really cringe. shit. Bizarre. Them, I mean... I don't understand. Because I was like the only year six and they were year seven. <laughs> oh, yeah, you just got, them. yeah, you kind of wrecked, got wrecked <laughs> from the sound of it. Wait, don't you have to go up when then when you're a certain age or something? It's a rite of passage, you know? Some shit. A right, an initiation ceremony. Yeah, they all <laughs> threw me into a river and set me on fire. <laughs> a Viking burial. <laughs> Wait, how do you guys want to be buried? Or like how cremated be... or whatever, because I know mine. I'm not going to die. Yours? Okay, yeah, so yeah, the way I would like to die is 
Um, I'd like someone to murder me because it is the most... Like, it is the biggest form of attention seeking that I can do in my entire life. <laughs> someone murdered. to care enough about me to, like, you, end my life. Uh, true, and then true. I want them to regret it and I want them to, like, tr try and, like, hide my body and I want it to ruin their lives and tear them apart just so someone's thinking about mm -hmm. me. And then, um... <laughs> Uh, do you know Victorian death photos? No, what are those? They what used those? to dress up dead people in like their Sunday best and sit them on chairs and then take a picture of them. Really? Like like they were alive. That's cool. I wish we did it's that It's so cool and I want that done to me and what? I want Actually, the person cool. who kills me to sit in like the picture like crying their eyes out as well. <laughs> I but I want one of just myself. I think it's more just interesting. Then... A bit... A bit creepy. Well it's gothic isn't it? Gothic. I'm not... I'm still... Gothic? 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 Thing. But yeah, well, as a, a goth in training, slash amateur goth, slash real goth, slash the only real goth. Slash he's not. <laughs> um, that was so unnecessary. <laughs> 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 anyway, so yeah, after that, I want them to take all of my teeth out and make what? like a really nice necklace huh? and then sell it to the cheapest porn shop that they can. That's P A W N for <laughs> yeah. the demonetization yeah, people. Not P O R N. Or would that you be just better? ruined it. Now we're gonna get demonetized. <laughs> or would that be better? <laughs> no. Anyway, I want to sell it to the cheapest pawn teeth. shop there is. You know, well, I want them to sell it, and then uh, I want them to dump my body in a river. But I want it to be found, and then I want them to try and do a like a funeral, and then that's it. It's a bit elaborate, isn't it? <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I, I just I just want to be put in a coffin and put in the ground. Done. Yeah. I like I like. That's my, all I expect of you. My space of ground. Um. You know. I. Uh, oh yeah, um, Oakwood. Um, I think I would want to. Oh, I don't want to die. Well, no, 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 we're not going to talk about how you want to die. Yeah, how, how, how I'd want. What, after how do you want to be buried? After I die, I want you, want you to just take my body and just like parade yeah. it around as if I'm still alive, like puppeteer it. Can you do like... a ventriloquist act? Yeah. Like, it's the HCU guys. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, what we were yeah. that's what we're planning on. I'm planning on using his body as a prop. Because by the time, it. okay, let's just say in five years. Which is how long I intend to live, by the way. Of course. Um, uh oh. Just. Uh, like, yeah. like by that point, they would have invented like something to like stop bodies from like rotting, right? So you could just salt. keep the it, just keep they? my like body around as like a prop. No, I will. Legitimately. You're expecting non-binary people to invent that for you? Yes. Hack Talking about they. Hack Why you're on the cast, actually? Hack me. Well, <laughs> Hack me. Can I please taxidermy you? I beg. So I can keep you around and like <laughs> I'm like a stand. That's Come awful. On. I hate you. That's such a good Hang idea. On. Okay, so Hassan, I'm planning to die in like what? As long I wanna live quite a long time and I want you to be the person that kills me in my death fantasy. <laughs> so we have a conflict of interest. <laughs> Let's get reasoned. Anyway. I'm not gonna do it. We're if, like if the I, same person I, anyway. I would I would do the killing and then I just leave the body and just like <laughs> fuck with it. Yeah, no. I know that, that no matter what I do, I can never be more to Reese than another one of the toys in his fucked up game. <laughs> They're my game of life. Everyone is a pawn. <laughs> and that's a pawn as P A W N. Shut up. And not P O R. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so it's not to get demonetized. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, YouTube. This is all in RP. It's not real. Don't worry. We're not actually going to kill these people. Yes. <laughs> Wait, could feed. this be used against me if like something okay, happened? Here's a, here's oh, yeah, a new topic. Um, but I mean, we're the, we're what the host. Imagine what, the police have to listen to the like half an hour. Do you just want to get rid of entirely? Just which population? Hang on, can you say that again? Because which parts yeah. of the population do you just want to get rid of entirely? The, Let's not talk about <laughs> that. Morons like you. Wish <laughs> you were gone. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, I have another very interesting <laughs> yeah. topic. Although it is you guys who are meant to bring up the topics, I think I'm a bit Look, more you're interested. You're not. You're not. Listen, you're, you're not a guest. You are a host. No. Am I? No, 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 no. You, know, you, just, you, you, happen, you are you just superior. Shut mm -hmm. up. Anyway, the topic that I have at hand, and I know I'm not supposed to go on my phone, so I'm gonna have to try and remember a lot of this. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> you're not meant to go on your phone. Yeah, you're not meant to go on your phone. No. Reese oh. told me if I go on my phone, then he'll get really, really angry. Yeah, we'll get angry. He we'll get said, angry. and I quote, you wouldn't like me when I'm angry. <laughs> I said, you wouldn't like me when you're angry, would you? And then I okay, so without making too much noise, I've managed to find the research I did into this last night. But there was also, this might get demonetized. Oh, thank God. 
apparently the human race is endangered as by 2045 it's expected that the average sperm count in men will be zero. You're already a man! Yeah. Wait, what? I don't believe that. Really? This is what happens no, actually, when people start using Reddit. Today about half the countries in the world, including the US, have fertility rates below the replacement level of 2.1 births. For one, things like CO2 accumulating and endocrine disrupting chemicals mean that the sperm count, like average sperm count, is dropping way too fast and by 2045 if nothing changes and like if things continue at the way they're going the average sperm count in men will be zero oh, so which is why we all need to become sigma males <laughs> dude 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 if i can you know what's the point what the fuck i don't believe what no. reese do you not know what sperm count you're is? so nah. stupid oh my god you're is. such an no, idiot I know what that is. Ah, that's so <laughs> funny you're so nah. incompetent <laughs> <What>? <laughs> What? Oh, you're me oh, you're mean. You're mean. It's anyway, not, I, I think that's really interesting. Like, we can see the end of the world happening, but then I think about climate change. We can always see the end of the world. We just don't do anything about it. But like, 2045, no more babies. Mm. I'm gonna have, Sounds I'll like have a really kids. shit campaign I'll have kids before 2045. I'm, I'll, I will live out my days in comfort. You know, it's gonna be like um. No one will have kids with you. <laughs> children of men. And no, that's false. Don't worry. My genetics are strong. My children Shut will up. have their children. Shut they it. Have good lives. Past age. <laughs> I don't Lock. know. I don't really Reese care. on 4chan. Like any fem anons want to have a baby with a uh, white guy? Oh, uh, never, never. You don't want a fem anon. Also, for all the liberal Great. viewers out there, I have never actually used 4chan. That was a joke. Oh, I Me always neither, use 4chan. Actually. Every I've never used 4chan. I, I go through phases every so often where I just go on it. Just 4chan chilling. scares me, but for the 4chan viewers watching the podcast, that was a joke. No, it's <laughs> great. It's a great site. I love it. I get some funnies from there every so often. It really worries me that you go on 4chan. Sometimes. Not often. Sometimes. You know, just to have a look at the uh, kino and shit. Oh. Every week, guys, shut up! <laughs> It's time for an intermission. Anyway, as I was saying, you know, like when like no no when you when you've drunk like all the all the squash out of the glass and you yeah. leave it for a bit, you get that little like stuff. Shut you get this like the dried squash Shut on the up. bottom of it, right? But then you so so you put that in the like the dishwasher and you clean it, right? But like. Uh, the, the dishwasher isn't like perfect, so you get like some little specks on the bottom of it. I hate you. Right, no, which you, isn't like, you, very nice. So you have to like wash it out in like the actual, um, you know, the washing up bowl with some soap and stuff. But then, then, then the sponge just gets covered in just grime. <laughs> right, right, right. So what you're saying and is then, I'm a very then, resilient and then, person. No, 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 and then some man breaks into your house and kills you. That's you. <laughs> Okay? Do you understand? <laughs> you understand my point, okay? You are unrelated to the story, and the only reason you're in it is to be disgusting! Alright, now that the intermission is over, let's go on our next <laughs> <laughs> Is that where the ad break is gonna no, go? No, that's the intermission. Modified. So it's gonna be a clip from, right. like, a previous thing that was either- You know how YouTube sometimes, sometimes have, like, buttons. funny ad breaks? Can we just make, like, a you really know, serious one? You know, I'm sponsored one? right now, so I need to bring up my sponsorship script at some point. No, no, no. Yeah, can, can we just make, like, a really serious, like, sponsor? Like, not- and, and, like, make it seem like it's real, and not even- and, like, never reveal that it's a joke. I'm at, can I read out my sponsorship script? Yeah, oh, sure. I mean, you came here to, to get promote to your somewhere. new album, didn't you? So, like, <laughs> no, I came here to promote the buzz. I'm contractually oh, obligated to promote. No, this is done. I'm done. I'm cutting I'm this done out. The... Yeah, cutting this out. This isn't happening. This isn't <laughs> Are the buzz on the HCU at war? No. Oh, really. But when, but you know, they're kind of, they kind of suck. Mm. Mm. Wow. No, no, I love them. But where's Pod Buzz mm. 2? I'm still, I'm still <laughs> fucking mad. We are actually so better. So much better. I was actually weekly. on like some of the recording for Pop Buzz too, and then I got self conscious and asked them to delete it all. So I might oh, they have a lot of they have a lot of me saying a lot of things that are like, thank God, you know. I'm glad for the liberal else. viewers right now. Don't listen to Hassan's part on the podcast. <laughs> oh, too. oh, no, yeah, by it's the not way, like that. It's not like that. By the way, um, if you guys are conservative, if you guys in the audience are conservative, female. And really like awesome. Shut then up, Reese. Put in the comments. <laughs> put in the comments. Shut it. Hey there, buddy. Can we please <laughs> meet? Question mark. Question mark. <laughs> dot dot dot. Can I just say? Awesome. I think one Don't of my go favorite... together. 
One of my favorite parts of this podcast is so far is just the the growing like joke that we have that we have every single like <laughs> yeah. group of people <laughs> oh, watching. No, 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 yeah, that's that's a long running running gag. Where every we... conceivable like. Well, yeah. oh, no, I wouldn't know because I don't watch this shit show. This is a great but, um, show, and yet, not... yet you no 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 you clamor and beg and plead to be on the cast and. I'll make my fans yeah. listen to this one so the viewer <laughs> rating might go up a bit. Yeah right. Yeah right. Yeah, right, yeah. <laughs> Can I just say how art sucks? All art is terrible. It doesn't, it's not. Do you make art, Reese? I, I'm on the, I'm, I, I created the, I created the ACU podcast. So. See, I don't think you make art, and I think that's like some random person on the street, like looking up at like a huge building and saying, Let's talk about. Buildings are awful. Sour grapes. <laughs> Sour grapes. Let's talk about depersonalization from your own work. What is that? I don't know what that means. Well, when you make something, it's like. I didn't make that. Yeah, no, okay, wait, this oh. is my problem. Oh. There's this, th- I probably shouldn't compare myself to this, but a lot of women get really depressed after they give birth. Oh, and that's why? how I feel. Like, when I'm doing a painting for, like, a few hours, like, like one pa- oil painting I did for one of my art pieces took, like, multiple days of hours of work. And after I'd done it, I felt so sad because I felt like it wasn't part of me anymore. Like, oh, the idea had left your body. <laughs> Essentially. Well, whilst I wasn't continually adding to it, like it didn't contribute to my worth anymore. I wasn't like, yeah. oh, I'm working on this painting. It's this painting no, exists, that. and I'm no longer doing it. I'm not yeah. exercising the skill. The skill has just happened, and there's no proof that it's still there. Yeah, yeah, I'm like that as well. Women get depressed when they have birth. Is it because the child is now separate from them? Because sometimes they give birth to children months. like me and you. Ah oh, no, no, no. no. <laughs> oh god. I, I, I it's called beloved. postnatal depression. It's actually something really interesting to post-natal look at depression. because no one bothers to understand any of this stuff. Mm-hmm. Postnatal depression. Maybe I'm that's by, just. I'm a, men. I mean. I don't. I don't know. I don't. I don't look that much into pregnancy information. I don't. It's because you're never ever gonna have kids with anyone ever. That's a lie. Ever. That's not true. I don't believe that. Um, I'm, Next I, episode, yeah, if you, you don't have, have a kid with you, YouTube. I'm blocking you. You're off. Hack me. Hack me. <laughs> I will have a child by the time I'm like 35 at the absolute fucking maximum, okay? Okay? <laughs> Take my word on that. Take my word on that. <laughs> go on. Go on. Go on. Reese, the only way you can yeah. have a child is if you go to the sperm donor place and give them a fake name and picture for the book. <laughs> what? No, 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 no. Nah, you gotta think positively. If you don't think positively, then there's no point. <laughs> Like, I just told you guys that the end of the world is 2045 and you're telling me to think <laughs> <positive>. <laughs> You know, 2045 is quite a way away. Like, you know, that's like an entire... By then you'll like... have had seven kids, Reese. So yeah, we're going yeah, by your I have to, you know, you need enough to sustain the world, you know? One day... I don't think we need any more witches. No offence to any other witches. I'm the last witcher! Like it's just me and my father. There's no, there's no more. And my grandmother. I'm the last. That is an easy kill list, I'm just saying. Oh, try it, try it, truly. <laughs> no, not for me. Obviously, if the police who are watching this, <laughs> for our police viewers out there, for the mafia one, viewers out there, sorry. Um. <laughs> yeah, for my solicitors in the crowd, can you please take note of all this and make sure that it, you note it down as <laughs> instead? Because that would be really. That would if be any, really if any, uh, if any lawyers are listening to this right now, solicitors. my name is um. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not true. It's a lie. You just lied in public. <laughs> I'll say yeah. Um, oh, oh, have you guys seen the I film think Westworld? That... The original from like 1967. Hello, people, and welcome to episode four of the HCU. This isn't episode four. This is episode <laughs> five. What are you going on about? It's Today we're on with our Westworld? special guest. Pluto. <laughs> we, Why are you starting you again? He does this sometimes. He just returns to what he was talking about earlier. Or, or not at all. It's really annoying. I wish he wouldn't do it. Mm-hmm. Oh, jeez. I miss Xbox 360. Hey, hey. Rest in peace. Speaking of topics, I heard you guys have prepared some topics. I, I actually have. Let's talk about the minions. Yeah, let's talk about the minions. I want to talk about minions. I love minions. I hate the min- minions, but I love the minions, you know? I think the minions are part of a really interesting phenomenon in which, uh, especially like the, the the ages that the minions movies and the there's big more movie me movies reach <laughs> are movies. children and like Gen X like adults yeah. who mm. arguably have the most influence over pop culture. <laughs> uh-huh. And the thing is about minions is that it was a word and now it's a character slash group of characters. And arguably, most minions in 
the public conscience are little yellow pill-shaped things with like eyes, even if they haven't seen the Wait. movie. It shifted from a word to that, and now if someone writes minions in like a fantasy novel, it's not going to mean anything except the fucking, sorry, the... <laughs> I unleash the my minions upon the earth. <laughs> yeah, minions. Minions. yeah. Kevin! Yeah. Ah, Kevin! It's ruined. <laughs> it's funny. It's... My oh, horde think... of minions were... Do you think the Among Us creators were inspired by the minion character? I was play? just... Oh, we're not talking about Among Us again. Look, look, I'm just saying, it's quite similar when you really look at it. Like, look at it, you know? They're quite, like, look at them. I've got one screen. I'm thinking about the list of topics you've prepared, and I'm thinking that it probably says Minions, Among Us. <laughs> do, you want me, do you want me to, le- do you want me to read it to you? Oh yeah, read yes. it, read it. Which Horrid Henry are you? Horrid Henry as a Netflix, oh Death Note Netflix, anime adaptations, oh, let's talk Minions, about Netflix. Baby. Can I, can I pause you there? Can we talk about the Netflix adaptation of Death yeah, Note? Yeah, I will talk about that. I fucking hate that film. It's awful. First of yeah. all, it is a shit film. It's so bad. I, I, love, how, I love how Netflix took like uh, a it's show really about good. like... About like someone trying to... To like become god and just made it into like a high school drama it's really funny it's so funny when you really think about it yeah the concept something that really upset me about the netflix one is that they called him light turner because it was a slap in the face that all the characters except l were white now yeah but it was even worse when they called him light turner (laughs) it's like how can we make them know how can we make blind people watching this film know (laughs) that he's caucasian (laughs) that he's a white male I feel like you know I that love? film is I love such a waste of like talent, resources, really. anything, time. I watched it on Halloween with some of my they even friends, got... and it made us grow further apart. Oh. <laughs> Good. You know what I particularly like about the film though? I like how L he just stuffs his face constantly. Like, <laughs> like in the why... anime or the, man- the manga, it's like kind of normal. He just likes to eat sweet things. But then in the in, in the in that Netflix adaptation, he's just like chowing down. All I the feel time. like I feel like the people who made that, so that film just like were like, oh, L, yeah, he he sits like that and he eats eats food in it. Yeah, Let's yeah. Put that in the film. Thought about. Yeah. I have an unpopular opinion that I think I really liked Al in the film. Uh, nah. I I actually okay okay I'm just gonna admit I have not seen this film. <laughs> You haven't seen it? Oh. Good, I don't want to see it. Yeah, no, that's fair. It's not but good, it's, it's really not good. It made I've me seen, really sad. No, also, okay, okay, okay. Mesa oh, oh, so dirty. Oh, I'll elaborate. I've, seen, the, I've seen, seen, I've seen a lot of it, but I haven't watched the whole thing like in one go. Do you remember what But Mesa the, Mesa the problem, one of the mi- big problems with diversity because if they had kept like it as like mostly Japanese characters or at least the main characters Japanese and made L black, that would have been fine. Like that would have been great. Yeah. That would have been a step forward. But the fact that they made everyone white made it feel like making L black was just. Well, we do that, have diversity, yeah. Yeah. even though th- we've taken like every Asian I'm character. I'm not racist. Is my one show. black friend L? <laughs> <laughs> L from fucking. <laughs> Death Note. <laughs> there he is. The thing is, I feel very connected with the character L from Death Note because for the anime viewers here watching the podcast, I do kin, and I feel oh. I really liked L in the film. So I think it would have been great if they did everything the same, except completely change the script and stop making everyone white. Oh, I love, I love Netflix. No, I, I hate don't. Netflix. I despise Netflix. Yeah, they okay, in terms so of uh, losing definitely. loads of money, hmm? I feel like in in the anime, like when, when, when oh, uh, spoiler, spoiler, uh, when nah, who gives a fuck? Everyone when Elle, like, you Death Note eventually now, really, yeah. dies, right? Yeah. Like I always felt like he kind of at that point had already like given up on like actually doing anything like he kind of had already accepted that he was gonna lose yeah i think so yeah i think you kind of i think it. the series got really boring after, no, after he died it I went so downhill up to then it was really good final scene though fresh final Still episode fresh. is good oh, yeah but like i think i really like that no, i just mistake. i didn't like a lot of the misa stuff like because yeah. it was really weird and creepy yeah. and it was just the point, objectification though, but it didn't ha- it didn't have the- much of it. it was just there to like please all the Viewers. Fan service, yeah. yeah this is yeah. my problem with like anime and manga because yeah. I enjoy oh, they have to some have of it. Service. It's just I hate how in anime well, all of the like women are like, you know what I mean, objectified. Yeah, yeah. and their character design is fan service, and like it's got to the point where like I used to be like, yeah, all anime has fan service, but now I just can't watch it because that's I, one of the main reasons why I just enough. don't watch that much anime anymore. Mm-hmm. I, I just find it really annoying. Like it's just irritating. 
And yet I tell you to watch Initial D, which doesn't really have that shit, and you're just like, oh, you're gonna look so good. I won't watch Initial D for uh, other reasons. Oh, come Can on. Can I recommend three good anime with no objectification? Oh, no. I Bunny Rain. Number one. I, I was gonna say that's number yeah. two. Number one is Keep Your Hands Off Isaacan, which is like an adventure slash kind that. of slice of life, which is about three girls who are at high school and they make anime together. And it's really, really heartwarming. I really enjoyed it. The second one is Hibernate Remnate, which is really triggering. Very good. But really good. Very mental health focused. That's mm -hmm. not a spoiler. Like, if you didn't figure out that while watching it, you're dumb. <laughs> Uh, and then number so. three is... What's number three? Oh, Shirakuma Cafe is a slice of life about a polar bear that owns a cafe. And I really like it. <laughs> I'm gonna watch the, the first one because you told me to watch it. Keep your hands off Isaac and I recommend to everyone because it made oh, me so, so happy. Me, you told me not to watch that and then I added it You're to my list. You're not one of everyone. My list. Yeah, no, I told Reese not to watch it. I've I told him to watch things it. like since the beginning of last year and he still I will get anything. around to it. I'm just busy. I have I'm scared that Reese will get his grubby mitts on the things I love. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, oh my god, that's so true. Oh, come on. No, you it's like, me. okay, okay. You that, fucking that, begged that, me. Let me, to let me watch explain this, right? I'll, I'll find something I like and I think, oh, who can I share this with? And then I think, oh, wait, who are my friends? And I think, wait. <laughs> It's just Reese. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on! See, here's the thing. Every time you say Reese is your only friend, my heart drops. I don't give a f No, no, I'm talking about the past here. Oh, okay. He's not my only friend. But... I got plenty. Good. The voices in your head and the children you groom on Gmod, right? No. Only the voices. Who else? <laughs> only the voices? <laughs> Who needs anyone else apart from myself? If, if I was constantly dependent on hack- on fucking- for my <laughs> livelihood, I think I'd just run away from my entire <laughs> life because it would just be so, so depressing. Think about it. Oh, Imagine so it's, that. Uh, oh, that's so Imagine sad. That. Okay. This I don't need. I don't share any. My... I try and get you to watch Initial D, but when you don't watch it, I'm not like. <gasps> <laughs> I'm like I'm like. Oh, you're, you're just a fucking idiot then. I, I, <laughs> it just my, it like, just cements me as being right in my head. And that's how I can remember. Part of my like ongoing greater observation and investigation into male friendships, the thing that I've learned the most is just how little codependence there is. Yeah. It's like it's scary to me. Not me. I'll, I'll admit to being a very dependent person. Of course. Well, no, but like, I, I, then like, like you can be dependent people, but I, I talk to people about their friendships, and they just, they didn't, like, they saw their friends as like people in their lives that are friends and not support they were just like friends like extra to that and like i've lived my life constantly feeling incredibly supported by my friends and hoping that the support i give back to them is good enough for them and always making sure yeah. that i'm doing my best and they do the same and that's how i've lived and i just find it wild that a lot of men that i've met have just not had i that think i think with the friends that they've had <laughs> Men, men are like too competitive to, to be supportive of each other, which is really sad. Mm -hmm. yeah. Shut up. <laughs> it's also to do with, obviously, men are victims of the patriarchy as well, in that mm -hmm. uh, the patriarchy being sustained means that men men hurt and uh, suffer too. Yeah. Because, like the, it's 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 everyone is a victim of the patriarchy. It's not a good mm -hmm. system for anyone. Like no one benefits. Mhm. Mm Although, for the Metroid yeah, fans, for, like, I'm talking about SJW stuff to, now. To all of our MGTOW viewers, um... Oh, I love MGTOW, <laughs> Actually, you can unsubscribe, to be honest. No, 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 stay to subscribed our, and, and To all of our Prager U, Sigma males... Oh, we, look, need to, no, we need to keep them on. Oh, I love you, MGTOW. <laughs> I was watching uh, Thank you. a commentary video about Sigma male stuff today, and it was really funny to me, because it was like, If you respect a woman, she'll leave. And I was like, what? Damn, bro. Ooh! Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh god, what's, what am I talking about? Oh yeah, Mugtow. Anyway, there really were cool. more topics we're on the list after that. Death Can we no please talk about I beg, I beg. I, I don't beg. want to. It's such a big part of my life. Not anymore. <laughs> Just... now. We know it's a big part of your life. It was, life. I used to scroll the Reddit sometimes. Not anymore. Really? Yeah. It's good. MGTOW it is one of the scariest things to me because it is a slippery slope into criminals. <laughs> criminals? <laughs> like, people who are violent I've... or like... <laughs> Harassing in like online verbally, Aye. anyway. Yeah. The average. When people, 
here's the thing that I I've been thinking a lot about is that a lot of people, especially when um uh movements like I don't know votes for women and then things as like uh present as like BLM come about, people who are not the oppressed people get really scared because to people who are privileged, equality feels like oppression because you're not getting the same treatment. And that's what Mixel feels like to me. It's like people who men are not oppressed in society in the same way that women are but it's like when they see women being empowered they're like why aren't we getting the the treatment that women are getting it's because you don't need it but like it feels like oppression and then it's like we need to be fucking pink pilled or whatever it was <laughs> because nah. why can't girls women propose to men silly. like that's not yeah i think it's a girl's color for girly guys girls. i took the blue pill because red is for girls <laughs> Navy blue, join the navy. Can you talk about the navy again, please? We didn't even get onto that. Anyway, can I please talk about the navy? That's way more SJW stuff than I was prepared to talk about, yeah. and I know I'm going to get docs. So now, now can so we talk can about you go the navy? Down on the topic list. Can we talk about the navy now, please. No. No, please. No. Please. The navy. No. Okay, who wants to brilliant. talk about the navy? Me. No one. And I, I can hear like three other people in my head that are saying yes. So like, we'll do it. <laughs> Worrying. <laughs> the navy ads are so fucking awesome. Let me just say, I've been like watching. I do them. like the Navy ads a lot. Right, next laugh. topic. It's like, <laughs> shut up. You know, what? before we before let's we go talk to the next about, topic, I'll just no say, one's watching average this male, point, so let's talk about your male greatest fear. Getting, there are two types of my great. Male. Okay, wait. I'm going to talk about my greatest please, fear. Please, please. You you have one <laughs> sentence. I have to one say sentence about to say. I have one sentence to say. Okay. There are two average males. One goes to get therapy, and then the other becomes like me. Full stop. That's it. <laughs> Oh. That's how it is <laughs> on this, on this, in this, on this world. What's the next topic then, Hackney? I didn't, I didn't, I didn't write any <laughs> topics for this. I just thought it'd flow naturally, and it does. I think we're talking about greatest fears. Dude, I went to, greatest I went to therapy fears. and they no gave fears. me these pills, but I didn't take any of them because they want red. Yeah, it's fucked up. Red is, red is the color of <laughs> You gotta dye the knowledge. pill red before you take it, boys. <laughs> True. I gotta put it in some food coloring. Yo, what the hell? Why are these pills? <laughs> Fuck. Nah, no. Alright, um. What's your greatest fear? Greatest fears? Greatest fear? I have no fears. None that are like. I wasn't or... talking to you. You, anyway, you scare so. me so much. I think one of my greatest fears is Reese because he's just. Oh my god! I, I don't know how to describe it. Stop. When I first met Reese in real life, I didn't really know that he was coming, and he was just behind me. And I turned around. I felt like this wave of unsettled, <laughs> like something was cataclysmic off, cataclysmically off with the universe. Yeah, it's like. Funny something was disrupted in my being and like your aura is incredibly powerful and like my fight or flight was like through oh, the that is, that and then is when i realized that you were like a bit of a weirdo it went a bit better that's my aspiration to just be a little bit yeah freaky just a little bit it doesn't help that when we went on a walk one time you kept like touching the back of my hair and taking pictures of that's me. not true you like made that up didn't... that didn't no that was true that, that actually did that happen that did not happen it happened in the- I'm not gonna say where, because like I don't want to reveal our city, but like in the center, revealed it, you like, kept going times. up behind and like, I think it was like twice, and you kept taking pictures of everyone, but well, that included I, me. I had my camera with me! What was I meant to do? Just leave it? That is not an excuse! <laughs> that is an excuse, that is an excuse, I had to- I had my knife it. with me, so I just stabbed some people. <laughs> <Shut> <laughs> no, I genuinely felt like I was on an episode of like, SVU. SVU? Like, oh, uh, can I just talk about Kenny? Special Victims Isn't Unit. Isn't it SUV, order. bro? <laughs> <laughs> Hate it here. <laughs> okay, let's just talk oh, about so Kenning, right? I like can the, bro. you know, on no, the no, graph. No, no, we're not talking about that. We are you, not you know, talking about Kenning. You know, on, you know on, on the graph how it has the um, like the line of best fit and then the anomaly. Yeah. 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 I can the anomaly. Do you can the anomaly? <laughs> you can That's the anomaly. quite funny. <laughs> oh god! Yeah. As long as we don't get into actual kin discussion, then it stays. Are we not? Are we no. talking about actual kin? Yeah, we're going, I want to go on greatest fears. What's your greatest fear? Pod, uh, name, food to go Didn't they already say uh, it? Me? Mm. <laughs> Full stop, yeah. There's no others. I don't know. I, I, I think that my greatest fear is... I've been thinking about this recently, and only very recently I've realised that my greatest fear is... Uh, what happens next? Because I've thought about my mortality a lot, oh, and I've realised that... Because yeah, mm. because I'm incredibly sexy. Like, there's not really <laughs> yeah. points in my life that I can't come I back like from. But if, like, if, after if my you life, die, like, there there won't be like another person. Yeah, that would reaches not. your level of attractiveness. You know? No, you're right. You're oh right. And see, here's my thing. Like, see, humanity's peaked. 
there is nothing I can't come back from because of how sexy I am. But like in the next life, what if I'm clapped? Oh, that's so true. Or what in the there afterlife, what if, what if I'm clapped? A next, next life. What if I'm clapped in the non-existent next life then? <laughs> On the day you die, you you're clapped, and then you're dead forever yeah. as a clapped person. <laughs> like I'm fucking minging like, in everyone's memory. That's the scariest. That's my greatest fear. Oh, that's hilarious. I wouldn't want to be clapped. That's hilarious. Okay, here's the thing. When I die, I don't want to like have like wounds and stuff, what do you mean? or like maybe just one. But like, I don't want to be like in pieces or anything like that. Yeah. I'd, I'd either I'd either want to like be killed like. I don't know, with toxic gas or something. You could or... just die. When you said in pieces, I really thought that they'd like scatter like different parts of you all over the world, like the Dragon Balls, <laughs> Wait, what, what? and someone Too would like reassemble you for another HCU or, podcast. Um, or, or I just want like no trace of my existence. So it's either, it's one That's of those a thing. Two things. That, the right to be forgotten is a thing where you can get like as much as your data removed legally as possible, but like obviously it doesn't work in today's mm -hmm. like internet age yeah why would you want to be someone will, like someone i swear after you're dead like however far away like th this date is like it could be in 80 years someone will comment on your metro <laughs> video like not good enough couldn't be in the game <laughs> true i'm so glad that that it, there's, there's a reason it's good to like do shit like this the podcast keep in a presence even after death i like I, it's gonna be decades before i die so i'm not like, even <laughs> i'm not even like scared i'm not concerned or worried about it like, what's I, your, when I think about my mortality, I've got, like, my greatest fear. I don't really... Yeah. I mean, like, I'd... You can break character in this episode. No, I'm not break... I don't have character. Oh. Like, I... Yes, you do. See, this you went... You went... Okay, 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 okay. I have a rant. rant. Not you have rant. a rant? An nah, go on. Nah, nah, come See, on. See, in year nine, Acrylic was... Yeah. Relative... Like, he, he, he do the... He do the act every so often. It was funny, right? Uh-huh. And at some point in year 11, you just got stuck, and he's just gone now. No, 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 I, I, mid year 10, I realized the truth. <laughs> and now... Here's my oh thing God. about the acrylic law. I don't think he's gone. I think he's buried deep somewhere, because when I first met acrylic, uh, oh. we were in a voice chat, and he played Club Penguin Mancala with me, and it was a really nice time. Like, I really enjoyed it. It was really funny. He kept cracking jokes. It was really chill. He was like fake annoyed at the amount of times I wanted to restart, but we ended up playing loads of games. It was really fun. I was like, wow, this guy's really nice. And then I met Acrylic. <laughs> yeah. And I was terrified. Yeah, you see. Yeah. Out of my wit. You know what that is? You know what that is? That, what? You know how you have to bait a fish? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly the what that is. The bait and switch. It is the bait and switch, precisely. Oh, and there is, there is there is no. I can't actually. believe I've been compared uh, yeah. to a fish on my own episode of the HCU but cast. You... That kind of scares me. By that, by that account, there is no, there is the me. The character and the me are are the same person now. There is no like facade. That's sad. Nah, it's not sad. I think it's still somewhere in there, and I think you know with how, years like, of corrective therapy, we can bring it back out. You guys know like in the emoji emoji movie where Gene's father <laughs> oh is like he has lots of emotions, but he's comfortably met. <laughs> That's Comparing me. yourself to an emoji. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Look, I would. <laughs> Look, you... I had to watch the Emoji Movie when I was on work experience in a school because they were all like, let's watch the Emoji Movie on like the last like celebration day of term. Yeah. And I had to sit in there because I had to make sure they weren't like biting each other. <laughs> I had to sit in there and watch the whole fucking Emoji <laughs> Movie and I never felt more like there were hours of my life oh, so good. that are lost. I I, that was the first moment I think in my childhood where I stopped wishing I had like was growing up because I was like in what year 10? And I was like, I want to be older, I want to be older, I want to mm -hmm. be older. And that's the first moment where I was like, there are hours of my life that have gone to waste, and this is one of them. Yeah. I love the Emoji movie. It's shit, but I love it. Also, I have to go eat tea, so can we, like, pause? Oh, no, no, we'll, we can wrap it up now. It's been an hour. Round oh, okay. Yeah, so... Can I do, like, a little exit, like, exit An outro? outro? I will do the outro, because I'm the fucking owner of the entire world. But no, nah, no, nah, I'll let you can have it. Can I do it. a nah, quick outro before that? You can do a little that. outro now. Go on. Give me a little outro. Uh, my name, thank you for watching my special episode. So thanks for watching for the HCU podcast. Pluto. My name is I am the Deez sexiest Nuts. person you'll ever meet. And remember my Instagram to, uh, I will put in the comments of this video. I will thanks for uh, watching, guys. Uh, I barely spoke this episode. <laughs> Sayonara, babes. And make sure Mwah. to like. Oh, yeah. And to everyone that's gotten this far, give it a like. Get on an alt account and comment the words... Ooh, baby, that is a spicy meat a ball.
and then yeah if you comment that we'll know that you got to this point and if you skip to the end fuck you i hate yeah, you yeah thanks babe okay no 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 if you watch till to this point go back in the cast and Reese is going to edit in a different message that you need to type in. Wait, what? And then he- No, if you've watched this whole thing, take the first letter of every word we say <laughs> and type it out in the We comments. don't even know what that's going to look like. <laughs> it could be anything. No, because Reese will see that and he'll look for a pattern and he'll like cry for years. Like, where's the pattern? They're trying to kill me. <laughs> nah, I'm not an actual maniac. I'm not anyway, like... I have to go. Oh, Thank you yeah. very much for having me on your amazing podcast. Shut I was scared, up. sad, this happy, cried, laughed, anything felt every before. human emotion, the real episode. except lust. Okay, the real episode. So this is a joke episode, guys. The real episode will be released uh, <laughs> tomorrow at 9 p.m. Hate it here. Okay, bye. Right, I'm closing my cast. I'm fucking recording shit and bullshit. Fuck. I fucking hate this cast.